Hello there guys, Crystal here. Welcome back to Rosebuff. Today is the 31st of January 2018. How is it already the end of January? What is even happening right now? I don't even know. I don't even know you guys. Anyways, I hope you guys are having a good evening, a good day, good morning, whatever time it is when you're watching this. You might not even be watching it today. You might be watching it a couple years down the road, in which case, hello time travelers. Um, <laughs> from Wade. So Crystal, uh, I love watching the birds in town. It seems like they're always chirping. I wonder if they write letters to each other too. I bet they have great airmail service. Wade, okay, one, technically you are a bird, and two, don't creep on Robin. Okay, that's kind of weird, hun. I'm sorry, but from Bud, why do I have so many presents? What's going on? Sorry to keep you waiting, thanks. Thank you for all your time capsule help the other day. I feel like we strengthened our friendship muscles. If you want to hit up some real weights together, speak up. I think I'm good. I think I'm good. From the camp- Oh! That's why we bought, uh, some stuff from the campground. So there was this, um, uh, counter table? Like, I call it a countertop, whatever. Um, that I wanted for our kitchen. And then we also got, I think, the Mabel and the Sable 3DSs, which- are pretty cool. I'm gonna start actually trying to collect those, my things. There's the Mabel one. Wait, did I just get two of the same one? Am I going crazy? No, Sable and me. Okay, cool. Um, let's see what Bud got us. The Pop Bloom Tea. Does not sound very wintry. And uh, the Unknown Machine, if you're wondering, O'Hare came over just before I was about to start recording. And, uh, and he gave me that, so. That's that. Let's head back into our kitchen. I forget what it even looks like at this point. Uh, put in this countertop. I really like it. You can customize it to look a little bit different. I think there's like three different designs. But uh, I really I really like the uh, this one. Just the standard, standard one. Oh, right. What is happening in here, you guys? What even, what is this? Uh, wait a minute. There we go. Okay, so it doesn't really go with anything just yet. But you know what? I like it. I kind of want my kitchen to have that kind of feel to it. Do you guys know what I mean? I don't even know what I mean. You know what? Let's just leave it. <laughs> Let's just head on out. Uh, but yeah, I had I had a quite a quite a bad couple of days here at work. It's just been kind of tense and. Not very nice, so I'm happy to be home and relaxing. Um, I hope you guys don't mind if I'm a little bit more quiet this episode. Maybe not as upbeat as I usually am. So Bob, Bob is not in. Bob is not in, but that's okay. Um, just see if we can find any fossils or anything like that quickly. I know I spend a lot of time doing dailies, but at the same time I feel like it's such an important part of this game still. <laughs> Shep, hello, how's it going, bud? Whoopsie. I wonder if you'd help me out now and in the- Okay, he just wants a, a time capsule buried. I can do that. Oh, I also forgot to put away the 3DSs, so I should probably go back and do that. I can't remember if villagers will ask for... Amiibo... Based, I, I mean, I guess, technically, uh, are those ex Amiibo exclusives or, I don't know. Either way, not gonna risk it. <laughs> Plant it right here like we did last time. Cool, there we go. So there's that done. Um, Let's go away and uh, put these away just because I don't want villagers to snaggle them from me. I don't really know where I'm gonna put them. I should probably put them downstairs in the recording studio I was working on. But I was thinking, you guys, I was thinking maybe this weekend what I'll do for the Animal Crossing streams because I find myself running out of things to do. Did I already have? No, that's not, that's not the same counter. Um, I think what I'm gonna end up doing- I don't have anywhere to put these. <laughs> I'm just gonna put them on the floor here and pretend like they belong there. Um, 
What I'm probably gonna end up doing is uh, having a bit more of a, I guess a work stream almost, where I work on the encyclopedia because we're very close to finishing those, or where I work uh, on my house because it's a giant mess right now. I don't really like how it's turning out, except for the main room. I like that main room, but I'm not gonna lie. That uh, Disco KK song is starting to really get on my nerves <laughs> after hearing it so much, so I might have to uh, change that or move it to a different room. But we'll see, we'll see. Um, well, I think the moon is really big tonight, is it? Gosh darn it. <laughs> I still can't see it. Where I live, at least, um, the moon was nearly full last night, IRL of course, and it was super super big and super bright. Uh, and I think we're supposed to be having like a super moon or something, but you're only supposed to be seeing it... Oh, I forget exactly where, but it's not where I am. <laughs> um, but the only noticeable difference is it's just been bigger and brighter than usual. Which kind of sucks, because it literally woke me up an hour earlier than I was used to this morning. I thought it was time to get up when it wasn't, and I only realized after I got dressed. <laughs> so I just stayed up, and now I'm pretty tired. Kinda sucks. Uh... What is this always here? Oh, very nice game. Fossils do not wait at bus stops, alright? I, I mean, you know what, technically- no, never mind. <laughs> Wait, oh, these two right there. Those are the new ones. I think we're nearly finished this uh, orange pathway going through the uh, the park. I don't know what we're gonna do after that. I have no plans for that park whatsoever. <laughs> cool. Um, let's water these. Alrighty, cool. Um, do, 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 do. Switch over to that. No villagers in these houses, but that's okay. How much pocket space do I have? Oh, we're fine. Cool. Um, what I've been doing, I've, I've been slowly reaching the purple flowers around this way. Um, just because I think the purple and the blue look really nice together. And uh, I've been putting the blue ones on the other side of Bob's house, if you guys know what I mean, right over here. There's like spaces that aren't filled in yet, so I've been just kind of swapping them back and forth. Like so, hello Peggy, when did you change into that shirt? Were you- do you change last episode and I've forgotten? It actually doesn't look that bad. Melvin and Robin are two peas in a pod. They shop together, eat together, play together. I'm not jealous or anything. I have like a bazillion friends, but their relationship is something special. That's cute. I didn't know they were so so close. A normal and a snooty villager? It's kind of cool. I'm okay with this. Um, da -da 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 -da. Fossils, nothing. This area down here still bothers me. I think I might clear out these trees and just have like... I don't know. I want some sort of design in flowers, but I don't know how large I'm gonna be able to make it, so... Oh, hi bud. What's up? So I really need to spice up my greeting. Oh no! You're keeping that for now, and then if you want to change it, ask me during streams. <laughs> That's the only time I'm changing them. It's up to you guys, not up to me. Unless it's something hilarious, but I don't usually come up with things like that very often, so... <laughs> you know what? I think I realized why I like Bud so much. As a kid, I had a stuffed toy who was, I guess a stuffed toy, but he was also a puppet. And his name was Tiggs. I still have him, actually. He's sitting in, in my closet, perched up there. But he's very delicate these days. His head is pretty much nearly falling off. Um, but he was a lion, and he looked a whole hell of a lot like uh, 
like Bud here, minus minus the glasses. Um, and minus the nose, actually. Tiggs had his nose ripped off by a dog <laughs> when I was quite young, and that was pretty traumatic. He recovered quite well, I'd say, though. <laughs> but, uh, question of the day on that topic, because I can't think of anything else, and I'm in a weird kind of mood. What was your childhood toy? Was it a stuffed toy? Was it an action figure? Was it even, like, maybe not even a toy? Was it a blanket? What was your thing as a kid that was just yours and you're pretty much inseparable from it? Who actually- I had another one growing up. I had this stuffed white cat. It's, oh, hi, bud. <laughs> it was very fluffy and I lost it. And I remember I lost it at the, uh, Ontario- no. It was either at the Science Center, the Ontario Science Center, or the the ROM, which is the Royal Ontario Museum. It was one or the other when I went there as a kid, and I was so distraught. <laughs> Sweat level hot pepper latte? Oh my goodness. Except Tiggs did not have your personality, bud. <laughs> You've been the- oh, I'm a bell pincher again, am I? Uh, no. Seems like rumors are just rumors. <laughs> yeah, excuse me. Ugh. Man, I was doing so well. Yeah. Bud, you show that bug. Um, everything is good here. I've already spoken to Shep. Haven't found Bob yet today. Actually, we haven't spoken to a whole bunch of villagers now that I think about it. And I feel like we don't see Static very often. He just kind of does his own thing. Nothing? Okay. Oops, hello there. Awesome. Glad I didn't miss that one. Okay, uh, so that's four fossils. Great stuff. Um, I'm gonna check down here just in case there's anything going on. I didn't think there would be, but just just in the off chance that there's like an item or something on the ground that I'm not aware of. I still love <laughs> Isabel trying to go through that space. That was hilarious. One of my new favorite things. Uh, duh, duh, duh. hi Melba. Did you change shirts again too? Because if you did, it's actually not that bad. I'm not going to complain. That's kind of cute. I wonder what Stag and Robin would say about their relationship. They seem to spend a lot of time arguing with each other and then making up. That sort of thing would wear me out. Okay, so apparently Robin is just the talk of the town in terms of her friendships with people. Villagers, animals, I don't know. <laughs> Then again, you know, Robin is the first... Actually, no, I don't think she was the first... I don't actually remember. Robin was one of the most recent ones to give us her uh, her villager picture, so... I'm assuming she likes us. <laughs> I hope, at least. <gasps> oh, she's back. Oh, no. Oh, no, this wasn't meant to be one of those episodes. I'm not ready for this. My body is not ready. I'm just gonna go over here. <laughs> That moon fall- I still can't- Gosh darn it, game. <laughs> Hurry up and move this way, moon. I want to see you. I guess- you know what? We'll see what she wants. We'll see what she wants. And I'll see if I can do it, but no promises because I'm bad at this. Yeah, <laughs> No, not really. Hi, Melba. Oh, <laughs> the bunny on her- <laughs> It looks like it's wiggling when she walks. Oh, that's beautiful. Sporty. Okay. Um, so if you guys actually were not uh, there or did not watch the stream later on when I uploaded it to YouTube a couple days? Weeks ago? I don't remember when this happened, actually. Um, we have passed one fashion check. Um, 
and I think it's because the theme was cute, I believe, and was it cute? I think it might have been cute, and the entire Santa outfit is cute, so I, I wore that, I think. I don't actually really remember, to be honest. <laughs> I believe it was cute. Either way, we passed one, and we only have, I think it's four more? I believe there's five in total you have to pass. Um, so we'll see if I can pull off Sporty. I don't- I don't know about that, to be honest. <laughs> okay, Blathers. The day when they introduce self- Like, even if it's like a skill- I don't, Actually, you know what? I don't know if I want skills in Animal Crossing. I love my RPGs and my skill building and my skill trees and stuff like that. I don't know if it would fit in with Animal Crossing, but even just having, like, an unlockable reward once you donate your fossils to be able to self-assess them. And I know I've talked about that before, by the way. I'm sorry for repeating myself. But, uh, that would be really nice. Also, I just realized it's the end of the month. I have to- I have to film a vlog for you guys. I always, like, do that a couple days late. I always mean to do it on, like, the last day of the month or the first, and I always just don't. <laughs> Pretty much. I'm really bad. I'm sorry. Cool. Okay, so. Um. Let's. Let's mosey on over here, shall we? Sell off everything we don't need and hope that we run into Bob on Main Street or the Evil Sisters or anywhere really because we need to have our daily dose of Bob and we haven't had it yet and that is a crime. <laughs> Which by the way, by the way you guys, I know, I know that Bob is in pocket camp. The amount of notifications I've had about it has been beautiful. I'm so happy you guys are excited, and I'm so happy that you guys think of me when you see this random purple cat from a video game. <laughs> um, I hope you guys are enjoying Pocket Camp. I haven't really been able to play it, mainly because my phone just does not like running it. Um, it'll run, but I just feel like I'm killing my phone every time I do it. But uh, good news is I'm going to be getting a new phone. I should be saying, I'm going to be purchasing a new phone, and phones are expensive, man. I, I grew up with like a flip phone, and I don't think it was that expensive. But anyway, um, yeah, I'll be getting a new phone, and then I should hopefully be able to play uh, Pocket Camp and get Bob for myself. If I still have an interest in the game. If I still have any interest. And that's the key thing. Uh, let's check out TIY. Oh, there's Bob. Speaking of, how's it going, hun? Hey! Funny me and you here, yep. What's up, dude? I never get tired of hanging out here. I- I do. I do. I don't like shopping. You guys, IRL, I really don't. This is going in the bathroom, by the way. I've decided that just now. Cool, okay. Um see if Leaf has any of the bushes that we're collecting. I think we need like two or three more of the pink hydrangeas and then we're done. But he hasn't been having them and that's super frustrating. Yeah, there we go. There's one. Okay. Um. No. I don't want that, please. No. Cool. Okay. Um. So let's pop into the Able Sisters. Just the end and kicks, I guess, just to see if they have anything sporty. Um, because I honestly don't know without looking at my closet. Oh gosh. Um, guys. Are you blocking my way? Like, what is happening right now? You guys freak me out sometimes, I swear. I'm sorry that I kicked you all out. I am, but... Actually, I think Wolfgang left intentionally? I don't remember. Oh, there's Robin. Everyone's talking about you today, Robin. Not to weird you out, there's Poppy with that darn shirt. <laughs> Why don't you try something a little more daring? Say, an open back dress? The only problem is I'm not sure there are many places in Rosewift to wear it. Yeah, that does not fit this at all. Is this sporty? Oh, 
Oh, it is. I'm buying it. I don't care if I already have a sporty shirt. I'm buying it. Yay. Okay, what about this? That looks official. Yeah. What about the thing next to it? Oh, <gasps> yay! <laughs> I couldn't find where she said sporty at first, so I was just like, am I not seeing it? What is this? <laughs> Alright. This is this is seeming a little bit more doable now, you guys. Maybe maybe we stand a chance here. These have to be sporty, come on. I look ridiculous. Yes! <laughs> yes, label! Thank you. Cool. Alright, kicks, don't let me down now. Do not let me down. Cool. Um, okay. Sporty? <gasps> oh, kicks, I love you, hon. You're a sweetheart. I'm sorry I haven't bought your amiibo yet. One day. Sporty? Oh, the game is being really nice to me today. It was not being nice last time. Alrighty, let me go get changed, you guys. I'm excited now. We got this. We have a full outfit. Don't even, Gracie. Don't even. You're moving here with what you mean you... It's not whether you want to or not. You're just moving here. Let me go change you guys. Give me a quick second here now. Oh gosh, that sign moving freaked me out. <laughs> oh gosh, darn it, my hiding space. My beautiful hiding space is being compromised. Uh, and these. Alrighty. You guys ready? I'm beautiful. Let's do it. My knees are exposed. I'm sorry, Celia. My knees and what was I? My knees are exposed and cold. That's what I was saying. I can't get over the goggles. <laughs> Gracie, look at my fashion. Gracie, look. Where are, are these like goggle glasses? What is this? That would not stay on your face. What? Anyway, look at my fashion. Sweaty and sporty. I got it. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> I see what you're trying to do here, honey. That's a bold m What two styles? Every- what? Sporty yet- Oh? Is it the flower? I can tell you were listening when I gave you that theme. Oh good, okay. I was- I was so scared that sporty and cute didn't- like, some of the styles don't go together and she refuses you. Oh, thank you! Oh my goodness, Melba, that bunny. <laughs> it's like hypnotic, I love it. I'm beautiful. Melba, we need to take a moment to praise the shirt bunny. Oh, look at it go. <laughs> That's hilarious, oh my goodness. Okay, so let's go take a look at what she gave us. I don't think it's anything I'm gonna want in my house, but I'm probably gonna keep it anyway because I'm sentimental like that. Alrighty. Let's see, what is this? Yeah, see like, I like this furniture set, I just- it's not for this house. It's not for this house at all. <laughs> That's okay though. Alrighty then, you guys, I think. Because nothing is gonna top this look. <laughs> I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Thank you very much for watching. 
I feel a bit better after filming it, not gonna lie. I feel a bit better after chatting and doing Animal Crossing stuff. But, uh, but yeah, thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time.